is uh, on the stage there, starting with our dear friend Nick and Mark. And then we have an amazing gentleman, also a must visit and a must see. And uh, did, you, did you guys know Paris Hilton? Is, she, is Paris Hilton known here at all? Okay, so yeah, Paris Hilton Nick photographed on June 8th. You know, many, many years later, but it was the exact same, and she was crying in the back of a police car. And the last time he shot a crying girl, it was Kim Fook. And that's one thing that people don't realize uh, about Nick, it's a documentary we're working on, and also this book that's coming out will show Nick's long uh, career. And, that, and we do have, at the exhibition, a variety of images from his time in Hollywood. So I hope that you guys can make it out and see his work. So you'll see, obviously, the most famous film. And I remember two TV cameras and sit down on Highway 1, they're running the film. And Papa was there to what is called uh, the tomato and frozen tail when they mixed it. Yeah. And, you know, you can't film uh, like he don't film a lot of food. That long? Yeah, yeah. The video, you know, you remember chicken, uh, the big camera? Yeah, you can all the time. I just went back to visit uh, two weeks ago uh, there. And now Highway 1 from Saigon to uh, Cambodia, Phnom Penh, very busy highway. So many shopping and uh, hundred, 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 over 100,000 people, a little bit more happy people. They uh, build the house right on highway. And the shopping, everywhere can a lot is the, the village today. And uh, so many restaurants. Every time I back to Vietnam, I always talk to Vila because I have so many TV interview me. And uh, I go back again next two weeks, another German TV interview. They want to do my story in the, in the business. Who is studying photography because, I mean, I don't think they can ever get another opportunity to learn from the masters, I mean, who are here in Jutan, Kochi. And so, I mean, this is another thing that we want to spread the message that uh, students of photography, uh, lovers of photography, people who would like to take photography to another art uh, on the Facebook page uh, and the uh, website of ours and uh, registrations are welcome because there are very few seats that we have for that. So that's another opportunity. Uh, also, uh, I mean, I think on the 14th, on the 14th and the 15th. Yeah, on the 14th we have Mark's workshop. And on 15th? Uh, on narrative building a narrative, cohesive narrative through images and on the 15th we have Nick himself to talk about uh, photography. So this month with 24 pages inside, the stories that you won't see at the exhibition, we have the Iraq photos, uh, and Iran photos on display, but uh, my work on Japanese tsunami and um, actually in the magazine my Japanese hot springs as well. And I did bring some of the books here, so if you guys want to take a look at the books later, we have them. I'm allowed to have favorites, I'll definitely say Nick is one of them. And not just because of the photos he shoots, but because of his spirit. I mean, here's a guy who covered the war in Vietnam from basically 1965 to 75. He was wounded three times, still has metal in his leg from one as we ever have a chance to meet. So uh, thank you so much for having us here, and I'm glad we could have Nick along here. Thank you very much.